Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76 daily notification video. In this video, I'll cover the Atomic Shop. What is new today? We got two items uh, coming back. One of them is I highly recommend. It's an outfit. And afterwards, we're also going to take a look at the daily challenges. I'll walk you through what are the challenges for today and uh, provide any tips and tricks if I know how to complete them. So let's not waste any time. Jump right into it. Alright, so let's go ahead and take a look at the Atomic Shop. As I said, there's an outfit. Oh wait, there's not just an outfit. There's the super angry emote. <laughs> I haven't seen this one before. Or maybe I have. Or maybe, I don't know. Yeah, it's an emote actually. Not... That's cool. It looks like Hulk. <laughs> so that means there are three new, new things today. I've uh, missed out on it. So then we have the returning back for a little bit of time, the Stalker outfit. Now this I highly recommend to get if you don't have it. I have it on PC, but not on Xbox. When you buy this outfit, you get the actual outfit, the bandana, which is the top bandana that I think it is. I mean, that is my favorite one, in the goggles. So it's a good, it's a good deal. And uh, I was. I'm on a little boycott, as you all already know. I already canceled my Fallout first, and I'm not going to be buying atoms, so I guess I'm just going to have to save up some atoms and buy this uh, outfit on the next return. Uh, then we have the top guy uh, photo pose. Pose. <laughs> yeah, I looked it up on the, the Google thing. Pose. <laughs> I don't know, it sounds weird. I think pause sounds. Well, pause, pause, pose. <laughs> oh man, I start. This is. This pose is going on my word that I hate list. <laughs> and uh, I think that's it. And I, I lost. Now, this one we had. Yeah, this one we all had. And the pose. Top guy. <laughs> Alright, so I just double checked just in case so I haven't missed anything uh, with the patch notes, and it is. It's the uh, super angry face, uh, the stalker outfit, and the tough guy pose. <laughs> Alright, let's take a look at the daily challenges. Alright, on today's menu, we got clean the workshop. Super easy to do. Kill anglers in the mire. E also easy to do. I do remember when I usually do it, but I don't think I have the location open on my Xbox and I hear somebody running in my camp. Uh, kill a legendary enemy at the Fisher side. Mm, pretty much doable. Depends how lucky you are. I'll show you how that is done. Uh, level up while and if you complete any of these sub challenges at the same time, then. Um, Take three photos. Let's make a little test. I'm gonna take those three photos before I do these daily challenges and see if I'm gonna glitch. Yeah, you know, if you have, if you don't know, sometimes it happens that when you do the, uh, well, not sometimes I don't know, but people tell me that if you do the nuclear winter challenge first, it will bug out all the other the remaining challenges and you will not be able to do them. So just to test it out, I'm gonna. Go ahead, log in, take three photos real quick, and see what happens. But before I do that, uh, let's uh, continue. So, if you level up and complete any of the following sub challenges at the same time, which is uh, level up while in Vault 94, engage PvP while fed, power armor, healing musical instrument as a weapon, Vatoga uh, on top of the world on the level 40, wearing unstoppable costume, formal wear, agricultural research center under level 10, and level 76 or higher. If you do any of these three at the same time, once you level up, you'll get additional 10 atoms on top. So nuclear winter, take three photos, you get a perk card, and scrap junk to produce springs. Okay, before we jump in, workshop, straight to the point, you capture whatever workshop, you get 10 atoms. Anglers in the mire, I usually, if I'm not mistaken, go to this place right here, but you're going to have to server hop, because I think there's like three or four of them over there. Uh, so server hop, and you will get that done. Uh, then challenges. Uh, let's go again. Kill a legendary enemy at the Fisher side. It all depends how lucky you are and if you engage the uh, engage a, a one star, two or whatever stars uh, scorch beast. 
and you will be able to do it as long as you kill him at the fisher site, like close. Uh, I don't have to show you fisher site, I hope. <laughs> and the uh, springs, bulk your springs and scrap the bulk, and you're done. Alright, so let me go ahead, jump to the uh, nuclear winter and see if it's gonna bug out my other challenges. Let's go to the nuclear winter. Alright, so let's do the challenge real quick. Uh, uh, photo mode. There we go. Uno. Duo. Three. Lol, I didn't trigger that, I've completed the challenge. What the hell? Challenges? Ah, oh, okay, it's completed. And now let's leave and see whether my other challenges got auto-completed or not. Alright, so let's take a look if the other challenges got auto-completed. I love these server loads on the, the normal mode. But anyway, I do apologize on the background noise, by the way, my kid is here. <laughs> Alright, let's go and take a look at the challenges they did not get auto completed so that's what I'm gonna do right now and Z Clan and everybody else you know Drew if you enjoyed the show don't forget to hit that like comment down below please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered nobody sees them I see them uh, I read them, but I delete them. Have that in mind. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine, and I'll see you on the next video. So, bye. From the ashes we rose, into the future we'll go. We are Z Clan.